Hello everyone and welcome to this reading. So I've been asked to do a reading for singles. You know, whether you are a twin flame and you're wanting a soul teacher in your life while you're waiting for union or to experience something new, or you are single and you're just ready for love, or you're just wondering what the future holds, this is the reading for you. So thank you for being here. And if you are new to the channel, welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. So I'm going to use two beautiful decks and I've just done a general reading with these over on my other channel, Pixie Power Tarot, and you may want to check that out too. But this is going to be what you need to know as a single woman or a single guy moving ahead in 2022. What will work for you, what will bring love in and what the next steps are. So we're going to use the Forest Fay by Nadia Turner. This is a beautiful deck and we're going to bring in the Earth Wisdom Oracle by Barbara Moore. So thank you, angels. What do we need to know, please, for singles? What do we need to know for singles or anyone wanting love or hoping for love in 2022? What guidance, please, can you give? Wow, beautiful card just came out there. I'm going to start with that one. What's the energy, please? What guidance can you give to singles for this year about finding love, bringing love in, being open to love? Let's try and get three cards coming out. So what do we need to know? What do we need to know? Jumping out there, there we go. Four, five cards, okay. So we're going to start with these ones, the earth wisdom. And, you know, we gain wisdom on the earth. You know, on our journey, we learn and grow. So you're being reminded that everything you go through with other people and when you're on your own is teaching you so much. And that's currently where you are now. You know, you're in this energy of nurturing the self surrendering giving it to god feeling at peace and feeling your freedom so you may be free you may be single you may be ready to share your life with someone i feel you've done a lot of deep healing lately you know you've been letting go of anything that's kind of been holding you back from new love you know maybe you felt like there was a twisted part of your past that you've had to release and you've been reflecting on that so the way is being made clear and they're showing me this beautiful kind of aqua colour energy as the energy of Archangel Shamuel. So he's helping you right now to find what you are seeking. So you may be seeking a new beginning. You may be seeking your twin flame journey. You may be seeking brand new love. You may be seeking something magical within your life and you now have the freedom like emotionally to be able to do that and to be able to handle that because you've been doing a lot of inner work so I feel this is a message about self-love and healing energy because the beautiful green of the earth is connected with Archangel Raphael so a lot of healing has been happening especially within your mind about how you see the world about how you see others in the world and how you see love and how you view things so even if you are a twin flame and, you know, you've just pretty much said, I've had enough of the connection, I'm done, I want something new. This is showing you that you are in the right mindset now to attract new things in. And, you know, if you're watching this and you're unsure, all paths lead home. You can't miss out on what's meant for you. So if you feel, and you know it yourself, you know, if you feel like your union is not coming yet, but you are ready for love now and you want to be able to share yourself with someone now and have beautiful loving experiences that's okay you know what's right for you is what's right for you so don't feel like you're going to miss out on anything or you're going to delay your union or anything else just be open to the new you know say to heaven i'm ready for what's ready for me i'm ready to seek something new i'm ready for adventure i'm ready for love i'm ready for wonderful beautiful things to enter my life and because you're in that energy, your prayer has been heard. Archangel Sandalfon, the angel of music, has heard your prayer for love, for excitement, for joy, for, you know, a new adventure in your life, a new beginning, and to start again. And Archangel Samuel is guiding you. And that beautiful flute is also about, you know, peace and harmony and joy and feeling at one with things. So the next card is awareness. Well, the number 13 and 13 is reminding you that luck is on your side. So it's a very lucky time for you right now. But you're also being divinely protected as you find your way. 
So you're becoming aware now of so much in your life and your journey. You know, you're looking around, you're more in the now, you know, you're more focused on things. So you're finding your way out of the darkness to the light. So you may have been through some dark times, some struggles, some dark night of the soul energy to get where you are now, to come into awareness of things. So you're aware of who you are, you're aware of you know, where you've been and where you want to go and what you want to achieve. So you're finding your way. So again, this is the energy where you may have been alone for a while. You may have been single for a while. You may have been in hermit mode doing a lot of healing. And now you're ready to find your way to something new. And the outcome is healing grief. Wow. So again, the angel saying you've been gaining all the knowledge, all the wisdom, all the power, all the strength especially around 2019 onwards to find your way forward. So for some of you, this may just be a reminder that your twin flame journey is real because I am feeling that. So even though you're wanting love and wanting that divine connection with someone, it may just be that the waiting and the time it's taking is kind of, it's, it's getting to you. And you're thinking, I want something new. Well, the angels are reminding you that you are gaining all the knowledge right now and all the wisdom and everything you need to, to move forward. So some of you are ready now for a fresh start because you feel you've healed something that's caused you a lot of pain. I do feel as well someone could be watching who has lost their twin, you know, in a, in a way where they've gone to the other side. So they may have passed over and you've been healing all of this grief, especially, you know, if it's happened around the energy of 2019. Or you've been healing the hurt from a past relationship or you've been letting go and you're ready for a new beginning. I'm also tapping in as well and I don't mean to but the angels are giving it to me because even though this is a reading for singles they're still showing me the energy of twin flames that the divine masculine now is so close to union with you or to moving into alignment with their true self, to be with their divine feminine. So there's also this real message to say, you know, if you're a twin flame and you know, you, you you still love your masculine. You just don't know when it's going to happen. Don't give up because it's so close. There's been so many changes and things healed since 2019. So many things occurring. And the owl is reminding you there to see things from a higher point of view. But, you know, you've done so much healing and growth to move you forward where you're meant to be. And, you know, you're becoming stronger spiritually, more psychic you're very independent and you kind of know what you want. So you have all the power to move ahead. We've got here, wow, we've got the Nemina. It says, seek inspiration in twilight wandering. So again, this has been about all the darkness and all the chaos and all those, you know, struggles that you've been going through has helped you become aware. It's given you an inspiration for the future. So you may just feel inspired to bring new adventure into your life and you want love you want to share that with somebody and we've got the owl again here so you may see owls right now really significant about what you're learning in the dark times the fact that you learn to see through the darkness to the light like the owl it's a nocturnal being but it has clear vision so you get clarity from the dark times and it says whisper secrets in the moonlight and find strength in stillness. So you've had to go within and go through stillness to find strength. So again, a big sign here about separation heals. The quiet times is when the magic occurs. So I do feel some of you watching need to hear this as twin flames as a big sign that you don't need to be in a relationship with anyone else. You just need to trust in the relationship with your twin. But things are happening in the moonlight hours in the dark time. So you're coming out the other side and you're realizing what you want from your heart space. You know, you're coming to terms with things. You're being very open about the future with yourself. And we've got the spell singer. It says, cast spells of wonder and delight. So, you know, you don't have to entice anyone in or do a love spell or any of these things. You just have to be authentic and be you. So when you're being you and operating from your higher self and being true to yourself, everything you want comes in. So the angels are saying to you, just be you. And then what's meant for you will be for you and will find you. And you don't have to try so hard to make anything happen or 
worry about anything just love being in the now and we've got the mandrake spirit it says keep yourself rooted in the earth spring is coming um dream it says spring is coming dream deep so again dreaming about what you want visualizing what you want knowing that the, the best is yet to come and that your spring is coming so the real message i've got coming through is that love is coming new love or rekindled love with your twin flame is coming around the spring and this is so powerful you know i know george has been talking a lot on his channel lately my twin blue eyes tarot about spring and we were talking about this last night because i always see the new year as when the chinese new year comes in which is the first of february this year the year of the water tiger all that bravery and courage he sees the new year as as spring as like you know, April time, Easter, rebirth, resurrection. So this is when things are all going to start falling into place. So if you really want to bring a new lover into your life, the time is now with your vision and your intention and what you're dreaming of, because things are going to start springing forward. You're going to start seeing things occurring as we move into the energy of March and April. And this is also going to be a potent time for twins coming together, sorting things out, moving forward. And we've also got she on, she says, she of the moss braff. And he says, not all things are as they seem, trust your intuition. So again, trust your intuition. Things are not all they seem. If you think, right, I want a new lover because my twin flame is with a karmic partner. Things are not always what they seem. You have to trust your intuition, your gut instinct, the way you feel, because that's what's real over anything else. So yes, this is a reading that says new love is coming for singles and for some of you in the springtime but also it's saying if you've tapped into this reading because you've had enough of waiting you're sick of your twin being with a karmic partner you really don't know what's next the angels are saying to you things are not always as they seem trust your intuition the best is yet to come you don't have to you know be anyone but you because when you are authentic in yourself what's meant for you will find you and when you keep yourself rooted you're in the awareness of the now and you realize who you are the illusion clears and you know that your dreams are coming true and things are springing forward and magic is coming in so trust in that beautiful things ahead nurture yourself right now the way is being made clear to bring everything to you and Archangel Shamuel, the finding angel, will help you to find what you are seeking. That may just be today clarity about your twin flame journey. Clarity that your union is ahead and that freedom is coming. It may be clarity that you're moving towards the right path at work or towards a new beginning. To feel more free, to have more time with yourself. Maybe you're being guided to break free from a karmic situation. Or you just really do want new love and the angels are asking you to keep the faith. You know, you don't have to try so hard or do anything. Just be you and the right people will be drawn to you because the angels will help you. So pray, talk to heaven, give it to heaven, trust in God and know all is well. I hope that helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.